were sneaking in. They thought they were bailing out. You put the pepper in the Vaseline, you should have heard them shouts again. Who put the pepper in a Vaseline? Who put the pepper in a Vaseline? Who put the pepper in a Vaseline? Oh, no, I can't stand the pain. Oh, no, I cannot stand the pain. <laughs> All right, right, right. It's so good to be back at Feet Camp, y'all. Thank you so much for coming out for this part of the day here. Kinda sound like waves crashing. I don't know. Oh, my guitar likes this humidity. It's spanning about an inch a minute. such a bore. Well, I got my headbands and my Gucci duds and I went up to work in the Idaho spud. Well, I wandered on down into Berlin town to find a cute little russet, knobby and brown. I said, sweet thing, I'll dig you later. Now I'm looking for the Idaho tater. Well, the Idaho spud was long and green, covered with butter and sour cream. Yes, pulled from the ground and washed off the mud of the neighbor was a tater like the Idaho Spud. Well, you can make it into vodka, you can make it into beer, you can eat it with a pizza or an old dead steer. Well, I never would have made it across the Idaho floods. I hadn't been eating on the Idaho Spud. Well, they eat the lobster on the coast of Maine and the Gila Monster down on the Texas Plains. Well, I got me the word from my Uncle Fudd. Never was a tater like the Idaho Spud. Everybody! The Idaho Spud was long and green, covered with butter and sour cream. Just pull it from the ground and wash off the mud. Oh, there never was a tater like the Idaho Spud. I learned this a song from a guy named Larry Hanks from up in uh, Bellingham, Washington, way back in uh, 82, I do believe. And, uh, he had just gotten to sing this song for the governor of Idaho when they were talking about putting in a nuclear waste isolation plant out in the desert up there. And uh, he sang this next verse, and now that nuclear waste isolation plant is in New Mexico. Well, there's nuclear waste on the desert floor, and the NRC wants to put in more. 
there's a hole in the ground where they're put in the crud. Radioactive Idaho spud. Now there's a cute little mutant on a cabin floor and another half kid that's stopping the door. They line right up like green tomatoes, feeding them radioactive taters. Well, the Idaho spud was glowing green, covered with butter and lauren green. Just pull it from the ground and wash off the mud. Oh, there never was a tater. Never was a tater. Never was a tater like the Idaho spud. A true story, I guess. I don't know. I don't know about the kids, but you know. Sure enough. <laughs> yeah. Oh boy. Well, he's a bad, bad man, though he's not stately. He's not the type of street fight and his suit is always clean. Yeah, he's gonna send you a packet if he thinks he's not on the team. He don't know much of nothing. He just flies around and screams. He's a bad, bad man, and he's bringing us all down. He's a bad, bad man, and I guess he's back in town. Oh, now we've all seen this kind of guy before. He preys upon your fears. He preys upon the poor. He prays that we won't figure out. He's rigging all the score. That old darkness is rising, and it's knocking at our door. Yeah, he's a bad, bad man. And he's bringing us all down. He's a bad, bad man. And I guess he's back in town. Yeah, Mussolini, Hitler, Trump and Putin too. You know, they're walking down that old same road the generations have been through. Yeah, but we will not be beaten and we will not be put down. Yeah, we, we're going to send them packing, yeah, and get them out of town. that up to you to figure out who that's about. I don't think it'll take long. Uh, yes, sir. Uh, can we all coordinate our watches? Okay. Ten minutes. Ten minutes to go. Well, you know, these are pretty good days, aren't they? These days, I tend to do a lot of dreaming. I've forgotten all my scheming and just try to be right in the here and now. These days, full of ever more distraction, I can find my satisfaction in the faces of you good friends gathered around. These are the brand new good old days. My used to was got stuck in yesterday. <laughs> Never more now than it is today. These are the brand new good old days. These days, I'm not getting any younger. Before time takes us under, I'm gonna live big every minute of every day. These days, I don't think much about tomorrow. But the time just can't be borrowed And tomorrow's just turned to yesterday So these are the brand new good old days That used to was got stuck in yesterday and It's never more now than it is today These are the brand new good old days
the brand new good old days. That used to was got stuck anyway. It's never more now than it is today. These are the brand new good old days. These are the brand new good old days. That's right, man. You gotta love every minute, every second of every day. Because you do not know when it goes away. Man, what a what a beautiful ceremony that was today. I, I love Bill's uh Bill's uh emphasis that this culture ain't going away, you know. And, and uh here's to the beauty you've built over all these years and Thanks for coming and sharing it. Yes, sir. Oh, yeah. All right. Yes, sir. I tune because I care, and I guess. Uh, thank God there's a machine for it these days, you know. Chicks and stones, bring on bones. No, we don't talk about when I'm gone. I'm gonna leave it high till I die. Just good from Tennessee, just as wicked as he could be. Never went to church or Sunday school. All he did was socialize, having a good time all his life. Hey, we got the congregation just to say, Well, I'm gonna leave it high till I die. This is the life I'm living in, I've been so very high. Sticks and stones, break on bones. Gonna come back about when I'm gone out. I'm gonna live it high. Keep it well. All right. Yeah, that's right. Folks, we got four minutes till that magical time. Yeah, so I, I guess I better do one more tune. Here's a short tune. This is the fast song I know. Thank you. I, I wrote that. Thank you. Thank you. You want to you hear the dance mix? That's how that works, you know. Uh, of course, uh, let me see. Uh, what, what song takes a minute to do? Uh, we could stretch it. I could, yeah, I could stretch it up. This land? Yeah. Well, why don't we just get right to the, you know, it's 420 somewhere, you know, you know. 
Isn't that how the country song goes? Something like that? Yeah. For 20. For 20, for 20, for 20 long years. I smoked lots of reefer, I drank lots of beer. Every day at 420, we're going to settle the score. And down in Henry's room, it's 20 past four. Everybody, 420, 420, 420 long years. Smoke pop with Henry, drank lots of beer. Pardon me, uh, feet camp. Y'all have a serious. Wow, this is amazing. I have never done that when the crowd didn't wasn't so short term memory impaired. It really surprised me that this is happening here. I mean, I, that's uh, wow. A dubious dis a dubious distinction, I guess it is. Wow, that's that's amazing. I don't even know what to do now. I mean, you know, you're supposed to laugh at the fact that you can't remember it. But Wanna try it again? All right. Maybe you'll forget it this time. Well, for 20, for 20, for 20 long years, smoked lots of reefer and drank lots of beer. Every day for 20, we're going to settle the score. And for 20 long years, it's been 20 past four. I know how to do it. All right, just the chairs. Four. Oh, yeah. <laughs> all right, all right. Ah, uh, well, for 20, for 20, for 20 long years. Smoked lots of reefer and drank lots of beer. If they at 420 are going to settle the score, and for 20 long years it's been 20 past four. And for 20 long years it's been 20 past four. You know, a, a funny thing that I've noticed up here is everybody who knew the lyrics doesn't have a watch on. How do you know when it's time, man? Well, it's always for a 20 in Henry's world, man. He's bad, man. And mine, too. Here's to you. <laughs> Got 
got a request to make one up for my friend James. I'll make one up for James anytime, any year. Gonna make one up for James right here. It's not a song about Mary Jane. This is a song about Jane. Jane and Hop, that's their name. They got this thing going on, living a good life. They got seven grandkids, yeah, sweet, sweet night. Up there in New Hampshire, coming down to the coast. Right here in Jamaica, probably the place they love the most. Jane and Hop, we love you. Yes, sir. All right. I know what y'all been doing since you got down here. Will these be the days we remember back before? Lost control of a country, the big money and the dogs of war. We should have seen it coming when the first thing in the door. They started trashing the air and water, saying we don't need them anymore. Election stolen, the networks told the line. It was business as usual, nobody called it a crime. All the pawns in place. They weren't wasting time But out here in the streets People marching, singing, carrying signs They're saying, oh, this is not normal And this has got to end Cause this is not who we are And love has got to win again The big corporations Telling us what to do Soil, money, and weapons, they don't care about you. Ah, oh, but we see what they're doing. Not everyone is confused. While gaslighting down a dead end street, singing these US blues. Surrealist newscast, a streaming every night. Well, they give me a feeling that something, well, it just ain't right. We're taking 10 steps backwards. 50 steps to the side But our truth ain't fiction I won't live a lie And there's foxes in a hen house The dog's out of the yard And the fences are all collapsing In their house 
How'd we get here, my brothers and sisters? How will the story end? There's idiocracy rising. How do we get back again? Back into a future we're all believing in. Where everybody matters and love is going to win again. Oh, this is not normal. And this has got to end. Because this is not who we are and love has got to win again. Oh, this is not normal. And it ain't as it's got to end. Because this is not who we are and love is going to win again. Love is going to win again. Everybody get together. Let's impeach the motherfucker right now. Sorry. Sorry. Saw that on my Facebook page the other day. <laughs> but come on, people now. Smile on your brother. Everybody get together. Try to love one another right now. Love is but a song we sing. Fear is the way we die. You can make the mountains rain, hear the angels sigh. Know the dove is on the wing, you need not know why. Come on, people now, smile on your brother, everybody get. Try to love one another right now, right now, right now. When you're down and confused, don't remember talking to concentration. Slip away. God, you start making one up and you just go with it, you know. Like, kind of did remind me though of somebody once said, Vince, man, you're amazing, man. You know, 70% of thousands of tunes. <laughs> <laughs> that was one of them 70% parts, folks. Sorry about that. Who knows that mystery chord, by the way? Anybody catch that one? <laughs> <laughs> It comes from within, it comes from without, with a little time, we're gonna figure it out, God only knows how flowers grow. This song is a pretty cool tune. It was written by my friend Ralph Roddenberry down there in Atlanta, Georgia. And he was hanging in Macon, Georgia, where uh, Dwayne Allman is buried, you know, hanging in the Rose Hill Cemetery. And uh, it was a tradition to go down there to Macon and hang out with uh, Dwayne. You know? And of course, they were uh, experimenting with some things in their mind. And, uh, and uh, sitting right next to Dwayne Allman's grave was this woman named Maud. Well, actually, Maude is the daughter of the woman buried next to the, right next to Dwayne is uh, this woman named uh, Jessica Reed. You know, the memory of uh, Elizabeth Reed. I'm sorry, not Jessica Reed. What am I talking about? Anyways, there's.
There's Elizabeth Reed sitting right next to Dwayne Allman's tombstone. And next to Elizabeth Reed, you know. You know, that, 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 that Elizabeth Reed, you know. So uh, right next to her is uh, her daughter, Maude. And it's a cement tombstone. And right between her and Elizabeth and Maude is this flower growing out of a concrete stone. And that's, that's what this song is about. Don't weep for me, cause I'm not gone. I'll be right here, you're not alone. Singing my song over my stone. I don't you know that it feels just like we're home. It comes from within, it comes from without. But with a little time, we're gonna figure it out. Mod only knows how flower grows between the stones. Standing all alone, standing all alone. I've been right here all this time. Thank you, my dear, for stopping by. Company when the show feels good, anywhere that you go, it's understood. It comes from within, it comes from without. With a little time, we're gonna figure it out. Mod only knows, Mod only knows how a flower grows. It comes from with <laughs> All right. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I thought my capo was right here, but it, it, it must come from within or something. Oh, here. Oh, here. It was without. Oh, here. Yeah, yeah. Come on within. Come on without. You won't see. Yeah. All right. Mountains are falling, getting pushed aside. I can't walk by that stream that used to run all cool and white. Since it's all been covered up now, that old mountainside where they're looking for old black coal. Now my kids found a way to work in these mountain towns when they took jobs down in the mines underground. But now the jobs and the money and the mountainside are all gone. And it just takes one machine now to tear a mountain down. Well, you can tear at a mountain, try to wash it down below. But you can't take the heart out of this Appalachian, Appalachian soul. What oh, is Appalachian, Appalachian soul? It's too quiet around here. There's nothing but them damn coal trucks rolling down. There's ghosts in the storefront. Everybody's leaving town. Going off to some bright light big city, get some cash to carry around. But I know someday they be coming home to this old mountain town. Well, you can tear in a mountain, try to wash it down below. But you can't take the heart out of
I think the coal company must cut my power off. Acoustic vacation. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, 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 that's it. All right, so I love West Virginia, old Kentucky, and Tennessee. You know, those sweet mountains have been home, sweet home to me. And I see them tearing them down I find it just too damn hard to believe It's just for that old black coat Wish I could walk beside that mountain stream once more Once they're gone, you know they're gone forevermore So I'm going back home, I'm going to speak my mind I ain't going to let them take no more I'll just mute me for a second, Howard. Howard, you're welcome. It's a totally different signal. Yeah, any, any, any time for you, bud. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Give it up for the feet crew, man. Aren't they amazing people? Yes, sir. And Island Gigs. All y'all. By the way, it's Sir Charles' birthday today, so. He didn't want me to tell. He didn't want me to tell anybody. Yeah. So we'll to, I, I don't know if he's here, but but if if he, oh good, he's not here. Okay, we can surprise him. If you see him, just say happy birthday to him. And yeah, that'll be good. Yeah, that'll work. How many of you feel more like you do now than when you got here? <laughs> All right, man. We're making progress. Well, here's a, here's a fresh one. I can remember it. Close enough, huh? Is this folk music? Close enough for folk music? It's great. 
growing old It's been taking so long I feel out of singing a different song But that light in our eyes That was a little bit wilder Is now shining brighter From the places we've gone And it's good night Good night Irene out there? Oh, something by the unknown hints is more. Well, I, I, that would be, uh, that'd, that'd be frightening. You know, unknown, unknown hints, and for those of you who don't know him, he's a performance artist guy uh, who is the most misogynistic character you would ever imagine, and it goes so far uh, that some people think it's funny. Uh, you know, a lot of people do. Uh, so I met him last week. I was hanging with him last week, and, and part of his act is he gets up on stage and he pulls a gun out of his pocket. <laughs> I ain't afraid of your husband, woman. You know, and that's his act, and I was talking to him last week. He says, man, he, he can't even do his act anymore, man. He can't pull a gun out in the club these days, man, you know. Remember the old days when you pull a gun out in the club and it was cool? Yeah. That was the last conversation I had with the unknown. I don't think we need to bring the unknown into this, really. I, I don't, come on now, Laura. You know better than to bring the unknown into this, really. <laughs> yeah, if you get a chance to see the unknown hints, and I, I wouldn't. <laughs> He's a character. You know, Bruce Hampton said he talked to him every day. My, my hero, Bruce Hampton, man. Um, he, he talked to the unknown every day. He and Billy Bob Thornton were writing the movie called The Life of the Unknown, you know, and they got as far as, like, you know, well, you know, the unknown, man, he, he, he wrote everything for Elvis, and when he finally, you know, came around, he got, they finally let him out of jail, you know, they threw him in some trumped up charges because he wanted the royalties from Elvis, you know, and he finally got out of jail, and, you know, he knows he ain't going to get the royalties anymore, but I'm going to, you know, release some chart toppers myself. And he had to came up with this great idea. Instead of you know putting out a record that has one or two hits on it, every one of them was a chart top and number one hit. <laughs> That's how the unknown operates. So. <laughs> All right, here, just a brief chorus. Put down the phone. You ain't calling the law on me. I, <laughs> I, I saw him play in Boulder one time, and. and uh, he was opening for the Reverend Horton Heat, which is kind of a rockabilly band, you know. And, uh, you know, he plays rockabilly music. He's a wicked guitarist, man, you know. And, and he, he does a couple rockabilly Billy tunes, and, and people aren't quite listening to the words, man. And then, then uh, on the third tune, he uh, said, we're going to, all right, People's Republic of Boulder, we're going to slow it down one time. Here's a little number called that restraining order you got on me. You can't do a thing. And the whole crowd, like, gasped and took, like, three steps back from the stage. Uh, but let's not talk about the Unknown Henson. <laughs> Sam Bush loves the Unknown Henson. Lynn Bush hates the Unknown Henson. Yeah. <laughs> Lynn, Lynn, yeah, Lynn makes a lot of sense. That's she, I'll tell you. <laughs> 
God, it sounds like it's 3 o'clock in the morning around here or something already, man. Why don't we get talking about this, man? Come on. That's the kind of request you got going on, man? Jeez. That's how we got here. I'm a redneck hippie. It don't make sense. I'm a redneck hippie. I'm for both sides of the fence. I'm a good old boy and I'm a flower child. I love to get stoned. I like to get wild. I'm a redneck hippie. What am I gonna do? What are you gonna do, do you? <laughs> well, my hair's not as long as it used to be, but it still hangs down to my back. And I see my boss in his flat top. I thank God that I'm not like that. I like that kick ass country band that used to be rocking and roll. But when it's party time, I let it all hang out and my hippie side takes control. I'm a redneck hippie, it don't make sense. I'm a redneck hippie, I'm for both sides of the fence. I'm a good old boy and I'm a dope smoking fiend. I love to get stoned, I like to get mean. I'm a redneck hippie, what am I gonna do? Well, I used to be a stoned out California kid with hair hanging down to my back. Well, I smoked my cools, I popped my pills, and I burned that incense down. I still like a buzz every now and then, but I turned my head around. And I got me a job just working real hard for the government. I'm a redneck hippie, it don't make sense. I'm a redneck hippie, I'm for both sides of the fence. I'm a good old boy and I'm a flower child. I love to get stoned. I like to get wild. I'm a redneck hippie. What am I gonna do? I'm a redneck and I'm a hippie. What am I gonna do? That's right. Fair and balanced. You decide. I'm gonna put on my tie-dyed shirt and go down to the festival. I'm gonna leave that corporate world. I'm gonna dance while the moon is full. Well, I got me jars of jellies. I got smoke to fill the air. And now what I need is a little hippie girl with a lot of hair. I need a fuzzy little hippie girl. I need you, fuzzy little hippie girl. I want you, fuzzy little hippie girl. Won't you come dance with me? Well, fuzzy little hippie girl, sing with me. Fuzzy little hippie girl, stay with me. Fuzzy little hippie girl, get on your twirl. I'm going to know her when I see her by that little twinkle in her eye. I'll be the first one over when the band starts getting high. Well, she dresses just like a gypsy, like an angel lost in time. And she wants to bring her girlfriend, honey. That would be fine. Well, I need a fuzzy little hippie girl. I got my fuzzy little hippie girls. I need you, fuzzy little hippie girl. Won't you come sing with me? Well, fuzzy little hippie girl, dance with me. Fuzzy little hippie girl, stay with me. Fuzzy little hippie girl, get on your twirl. I got bongos in my in my in my, in my, uh, in my van. No, my van's not here. Uh, in, in, in my room? No, I, I don't have no bongos. Bongos in the tent. For the drum circle after the show. What do you think, a drum circle tonight, man? Maybe like five or six in the morning, man. Like, <laughs> well, I got me an extra cooler because running out of beer is a no-no. Let's play count the stars and roll around in each other's arms. Fuzzy little hippie girl, please share with me your charm. I need a fuzzy little hippie girl. I need you, fuzzy little hippie girl. I want you. Fuzzy little hippie girl, won't you come dance with me? Well, fuzzy little hippie girl, sing with me. Fuzzy little hippie girl, stay with me. Fuzzy little hippie girl, get on your twirl. Well, now, fuzzy little hippie girl, get on your twirl. What a ball, man. What a beautiful place to be with y'all. I'll tell you, man. Well, like 
Five a mile, did not sail the sea. I swim the hot tub, I climb the tree. Just to be wherever you be, I got to get back to you. Oh, little Liza, just get back to you. Oh, little Liza, just get back to you. I walk through the desert, break in the sun, dance on the fire, drink up the rum. I'll be back by the morning sun, cause I got to get back to you. Oh, little Liza, just to get back to you. I'll be back by the morning light Cause I got to get back to you in the good life is what this is, man. What's that? Oh, boy. Stay away from that guy, man. He's been up on Rooney Mountain, man. Rooney Mountain is, it was this festival. They, they stopped having it, man. They just had to, man. It was up at the top of this mountain, and if it didn't rain, which it always did, the fire department came up and soaked the dance floor in water anyways, man. It was about a foot deep of mud. And we, we went there one time. And we're, it was about 10 in the morning. We're, we're cruising on to up the mountain, up this dirt road on our school bus. And we're looking all around us. And everybody that was still up at 10 in the morning is carrying this jug of moonshine. And there's like sticks of dynamite going off in the woods. And we <laughs> discovered that it was the highest concentration of explosives and moonshine that you'd ever want to be a part of and, and uh, we parked our bus at the intersection of these two paths and somebody you know just threw some mud on the side so everybody who walked past that intersection threw mud on the side of our bus and we left <laughs> with one side of the bus just absolutely covered I had to scrape it off with with like shovels before we left and then we had to paint it it was a yellow school bus and one side was brown so we we had to paint one side a little more yellow Anyways, Rooney Mountain. They'd have a different theme every year. The year we were there is Rooney till you're puny. Rooney, it ain't no picnic. Ro yeah, Rooney till your dog don't know you. <laughs> Stay away from that guy. But, I mean, I guess I've implicated myself because I was there too. I don't know. <laughs> you think we don't know you? I'm gonna ride me a riverboat one of these days. Take this guitar and float one of these days. I ride the river down to New Orleans. A few good friends and my sweet little queen. Telling stories about the times we'd seen one of these days. Find a place to call home one of these days. A little farm of my own one of these days. Chickens and goats, the river to flow. Singing songs, my sweet baby wrote. Oh, now I'm gonna hit the wrong note. One of these days. One of these days. I'm gonna take the time and ride that river. My mind, and then he roll, roll, roll like a fishing line. Well, I take my time one of these days. I 
Take me to Jackson Square one of these days. Yeah. Let that new wall and say, hey, give me a call. Second line me off to my grave One of these days That's it, one of these days I'm gonna take the time To ride that river Listen to my mind yeah, Let it roll, roll, roll Like a fishing line Well, i take my time One of these days Thank you for coming and listening, man. We're going to roll down to New Orleans all night. Oh, yeah. Thanks, y'all. Festival!